Hi you guys, welcome to my grocery haul video for this week. So I am totally mixing it up from my usual Walmart grocery haul. I went to Trader Joe's, I was still under budget, got a ton of really awesome stuff. Trader Joe's has the best snacks. I got so many different kinds of snacks, like a lot of snacks. So I was still under budget at $176, got all of our food for dinner and everything we need for the week. So I will share with you everything we got. If you're new to my channel, make sure you click subscribe. I share with you my grocery haul every single week. And then I share with you our what's for dinner videos. Um, I have a lot of crock pot recipe videos. So make sure you subscribe and check out all my other videos as well. Let me show you the groceries I got for the week. All right, so here is everything from Trader Joe's. I don't get to Trader Joe's very often. We don't have one very close to our house, but when we, I do get to go, I have so much fun. They have just really awesome stuff. So I had to get kind of our, all of our staples. Um, gallon of milk. I got some pears this week. Um, we had pears a few weeks ago and they're just delicious and I always forget to get them. So got some pears. Got the bananas that we need. We always have bananas for the week. Strawberries I get also every week. I put them in the boys' lunches for school. Always get lots of apples. I got some frozen edamame. I usually get this at my Walmart, but this was cheaper um, at Trader Joe's. So definitely wanted to stock up, and I have been really into edamame lately. It's super good for you, so love it. Got some of that. I got these salmon pinwheels. I think they just look absolutely delicious so it's stuffed with spinach and mediterranean style herb feta cheese wrapped in salmon oh my gosh this was only 11 dollars, so delicious and those are pretty big pieces of salmon i got three avocados we go through about three avocados a week got our eggs um cereal this cereal is super good the vanilla almond clusters it's kind of like a honey bunches of oats sort of um, really, really good. All, all this is basically Trader Joe's brand stuff. I saw this protein pancake mix, and I usually get the Kodiak's mix from Walmart, but thought we would try this. Um, all you do is add water, so um, this should be good. I love anything that has extra protein in it. 10 grams of protein and 29 grams of whole grains and two pancakes, so that's awesome. I love my kids to go to school with protein in their bellies. Uh, some shredded cheddar cheese. I got these cheese tortellinis. I got these for my kids a while back when I went to Trader Joe's. I can't remember when. Definitely a few months ago. And they loved this one. Um, they definitely prefer it over the Great Value Walmart brand. So got one of these for dinner one night. Some chicken. We always need lots of chicken. I got this vegetable fried rice. And I just got the vegetable one. And I'm going to add some chicken to it, but super easy, ready in five minutes. Um, delicious. We have super duper busy weeknights. We're in the middle of baseball season with the boys. So a lot of super easy dinners this week, which I am very excited about. I got some butternut squash zigzags. I forgot how much my kids loved these. And I think it's the shape, honestly. They're like kind of like little French fries and anything shaped like like a french fry or anything kind of fun is definitely tastes better for sure so got some of these butternut squash zigzags they'll be delicious i got a few different yogurts to try um kind of a bigger vanilla greek yogurt one but all these other ones look good this is a mango strawberry vanilla bean and then this one i just had to get it um coconut cream looks delicious um under here this is just chicken so i'm gonna use some of this, we'll use this for lunches, but some of it will go in the fried rice as well. So just awesome and very, very convenient. I usually prefer to just cook all my own food, but Trader Joe's has so many convenient meals that they're just hard to pass up. This one, chicken marsala with mashed potatoes. So there's two servings in here. My kids won't, they won't eat chicken marsala. So this is perfect for my husband and I, and then I can make my kids some spaghetti and meatballs usually is their go-to or tacos so um really awesome love this you just heat and serve this beef and broccoli we love beef and broccoli so this will be really delicious and this is a big this is a big bag let's see there's six servings in here so definitely we'll have leftovers on that one so i was going through their protein bar section they had so much to choose from 
Um, got some RX bars, a couple. My husband's been really wanting snacks with less sugar or no sugar. Um, so this one is a blueberry one. This one is chocolate sea salt. And then I ate this one <laughs> on the way home. Um, but this protein bar has 20 grams of protein, and it was really good. Uh, it had some caramel in there. Definitely delicious. And then another one from that brand. This one's caramel also. Caramel cashew protein bar. 20 grams of protein. I have been really into trying to get more protein lately. I wanted to get some dark chocolate. I just love dark chocolate. And so these little bars, 100 calories per bar. Um, so, and there's two, two bars per serving. So really just fun just to have kind of back in the pantry. I don't have to let anyone know that I got that. It could be just for me. <laughs> um, so here's kind of the snack shit section. I got these apple rings. I love these so, so good. And my kids last time we had something similar. They really liked them. So just a fun little sweet snack. Um, I got this raspberry kind of jelly, raspberry preserves. I think I'm, I'm going to use this for an appetizer that I'm going to make coming up for a party that we're going to. I'm going to put it on crescent roll dough and um, some brie cheese. But, um, but I won't use all that for the appetizer, but this looks absolutely delicious. So snack snacks, veggie sticks, delicious. These will be great for our baseball games to have snacks um, for or after in between. White cheddar flavored little popcorn, kind of like the airy popcorn. Love that stuff. So I got dried apricots. I haven't gotten dried apricots in a while. They're one of my favorite snacks. These, I just love. We love Cheetos, but I do not buy them ever. They're so messy with the orange, like powdery cheese. And we just don't do chips. I just feel like they're not that healthy. But baked chips i definitely had to grab some of these cheese flavored corn snacks so 40 percent less fat than regular fried cheese flavored snacks so like cheetos um so definitely some of those had to get and then we always need lots of nuts there's some um walnuts some nut mix um definitely delicious so i always have to get these pretzel sticks when i go to trader joe's so they have a tiny bit of baked in honey flavor and they're a pretzel stick. Very, very good. So definitely always have to get them. And they're only $2.29, I believe, um, for a bag. So definitely I cannot go to Trader Joe's without getting these. A couple bottles of wine, Trader Joe's brand, nothing fancy. This Cocobon brand, um, it's just kind of red blend, um, but good. And I can really usually only find this at Trader Joe's. So I wanted to stock up on a couple of those. So this is the grocery haul for the week. Love Trader Joe's. Love getting some of their like pre-made dinners and snacks. Just makes everything really convenient. I was so happy I still stayed under budget and got five dinners out of all of this plus what we need for breakfast and snacks and everything else. So still on budget, which makes me happy. I hope you enjoyed this week's grocery haul. Next week, I'll be back to Walmart to get everything that we need that I normally get, but this was fun to do Trader Joe's for this week. If you're new to my channel, make sure you click subscribe, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.